Just below the deltoid insertion, on the lateral aspect of the humerus, we can sometimes palpate the shaft of the humerus, around which the radial nerve passes inferiorly. Moving distally, we come to the lateral supracondylar ridge of the humerus, which ultimately becomes the lateral epicondyle. We can drop off the lateral epicondyle into the radiohumeral joint, a small gap between the lateral humeral condyle and the head of the radius. Just distal to this joint is the rounded head of radius, which you can feel rotate with pronation and supination. On the medial side of the humerus, we have the medial supracondylar ridge, which terminates at the medial epicondyle of the humerus. With the elbow flexed, the olecranon process of the ulna is easily palpated as the large elbow bone. Just above the olecranon, we should feel the olecranon fossa, the small depression in the humerus where the olecranon process sits in extension deep to the triceps tendon.